Hey guys, got a video coming for you. We're gonna unbox the Rebel 5G phone, and the video is about to start. We got the beats from Tanaso Lit, ChosenBeats.club. Make sure you guys check him out. Tanaso Lit, ChosenBeats.club is his website. The video is about to start now. How we've existed. I hear a lot of people talking like they politicians and choose to be. In hey guys, what's going on? Guess what we got? We got that T-Mobile Rebel 5G, guys. That Rebel 5G. So we're gonna go over a few little key specs on it real quick, and then we're gonna do this unboxing, guys. Uh, it's a 6.53 inch FHD LCD screen with a 19 by 5 by 9 aspect ratio. Has the the Qualcomm Snapdragon 765 5G. And it's only a sub-6 5G band phone. So it's LTE plus sub-6 5G. Uh, it's going to be 48 megapixel camera with an 8 megapixel ultra wide lens and a 5 megapixel macro. And, and of course it's running on Android 10 with a 4500 milliamp battery and 6 gigs of RAM with 128 gigabytes of internal storage, guys. So let's, let's open this thing up. Let's see here, get this thing. Ah, let's crack her open. Yeah. Let's see. There we go. Get it. Slid right out easily, guys. There we go. Oh man, it has a magenta button. Oh man. Look at that. Magenta power button. Oh no, another phone with a tramp stamp. What the fuck? What the hell's going on over here? Excuse my language, guys. What's going on with this? What's up with the tram stamp, guys? And look at that. It has, like, I guess, like a magenta sw uh, swirl to it. As you can tell, there's the three cameras. All right, let's turn this bad boy on. Of course, we got the famous... Sorry, guys, I'm just... Just got the phone not too long ago. I'm just doing this out of the car. Screw it. We're just doing this wild and free. I mean, it feels... It doesn't feel bad. You can tell the back is glass. So there you go, she's booting up. You got the magenta screen. We got the little front facing camera right there. Let me, uh, I can't remember what the megapixel is on that cam, on that front camera. It's a 16 megapixel front cam. So that's not bad. Here. All right, I'm gonna set this up, guys, real quick, and then I'll be right back. Hey guys, as we're going through the setup, we're finishing it up. There's this thing called NXT Vision, and I guess it's supposed to help improve your multimedia game, photo, video, visual experience. Might make your image brighter, richer, and clearer. Recommended to keep on. So it has visual enhancements, and then. SDR to HDR. That's pretty interesting. So setup complete. Uh oh. We're gonna decline. We don't want them snooping around. There you go. You get a magenta little uh, background. You get the Amazon app, Facebook preloaded. Let's see. It's pretty uh, vanilla based actually. I, I'm pretty surprised. Pretty vanilla based Android. Pretty simple. Here. Yeah, it's pretty vanilla based uh, Android. Not bad, so it gives you the option. So I guess to rich in the system, let's just make sure that it's up to date. Let's see, where's the software update section right here? Just make sure it's up to date this thing. System. There we go. Got to make sure it's up to date, guys. Always got to make sure. Oh, see, we already got a system update. Okay, so while that's doing it, let's just check out, like, the camera. Let's see. I'll include some sample photos here in the video at the end. So, um, it does all right. So, what the heck? Does why okay but where's does it have less than one megapixel no okay so it's just basically 
So it's just one, one X and two X, huh? Let's see here. So it takes a second for it to take a picture, but wow, it actually looks uh, pretty decent. I'll include some of those photos. Here, let's download, uh, let's check the modem out on this phone. Okay, so you swipe your right, it gives you your Google stuff. What is this, T oh, it gives you T-Mobile stuff too. Sorry guys, my T-Mobile service over here is not that great. Oh, it might take a second. Oh, I guess it just has a T-Mobile tab for some odd reason. Okay. Let's here. Let's download. Uh, let's get some speed test apps here. I'll be right back. Let me download these apps real quick, and I'll get back to this video here in a second, guys. All right, guys. We got the speed test app downloaded. Let's check this out. Let's see if this modem on this phone does actually pretty decent. Oh man. And these beats are by Tana So Lit, Chosen Beats Club. Chosen Beats Club guys. Check them out. You want that fire fire? Slap a Tana Beats. Kinda so lit. At Chosen Beat Stock Club. Let's do another test. Eighty three ping, eighty one jitter. Yeah. Okay, I mean other than that guys, this guy, this phone's pretty cool man, like it's not that bad for what it is, very limited like apps, you know there's a few T-Mobile apps in here but nothing too crazy, so what is this, T-Mobile have their own messaging app now, RCS tips, wow, so it has RCS but in a magenta logo, so you get the RCS magenta logo, alright let's do, the, you know what, we haven't tested the fingerprint scanner, let's test that. It's supposed to have a fingerprint scanner. Damn, this thing is warm already. Holy crap. Battery's at 53%. It was at 57. Man, this thing does get kind of warm. Yeah, this modem, like around this area back here, it's hard. you could feel it like there's a lot of heat. Damn. Man. It's the 5G, probably. Let's see here. Uh... Oh no, it's security. Where's the security? Here we go. Let's do a fingerprint. So for the sake of this video, we're just gonna make the password 7112. Just for the sake of this video. Now uh, let's do that. Okay, let's register this print. Let's set up this fingerprint, guys. So the fingerprint sensor is in the back right here. Which is actually pretty cool. I think it's the pixel that does it in the back. So let's register this bad boy. Okay, so the fingerprint's added. All right, let's lock it up. Let's see how fast this fingerprint reader is. Oh man, oh there we go. So it took the second try, let's see again. Nope, second try. So the fingerprint, oh there we go. 
So it depends. Sometimes it'll do it in the first try. Sometimes it'll do it in the second try or third try. So let's see here. Okay, first try. Okay, there you go. Not bad. It's actually pretty responsive, pretty quick. And it also has, uh, if I saw in here correctly, it has Face ID too. Or you can do a Face ID Protect. Let's see, I know I saw here somewhere. Let's see, for the sake of this video, with 7112 the pin. So you get the pattern, the fingerprint. I know I saw it somewhere. Oh, there you go, Face Key. So if you want to do the Face Unlock, you can do the Face Unlock too. I don't know how much I would trust it coming from a 399 phone uh, standpoint. Oh yeah, guys, one thing I forgot that we forgot to do is check out the accessories. Damn, I knew I forgot something. So let's see, it comes with your T-Mobile R15 SIM, which is the one that you need for the standalone 5G, so it comes with that. But we just used our old SIM card for purposes of this video. Uh, let's see here. Let's see if it comes with anything interesting in here. Comes with a T-Mobile starter guide. Comes with a El Cheapy SIM tool. So El Cheapy SIM tool. And then let's see here. Okay, we got a cable here. Let's take this bad boy out. Oh wow, this is actually braided. USB A to C. Is that C? Yeah, C. Wow, but it's actually braided. Wow, this is nice. So it's a braided cable. And then we got the charging brick T-Mobile branded. And of course, you know, they have to make sure that their branding was on it. Let's see, what is this? Uh, 18 watt brick. Not bad. So we got a decent, this, this, a decent charging station. And it's, the phone is pretty warm right now. But, I mean, it's a decent phone uh, so far. But, of course, you know, I'm going to try it out for a little bit, guys. And I'll let you guys know. And I am going to include the pictures at the end of this video. Thank you guys for checking out this video on this unboxing. I know it's not a lot, guys. But, you know, we try to make it happen. And uh, we're going to do a giveaway on this phone. I know I have not done the 500 sub giveaway. Uh, iPhone, right now, that iPhone is no good. So we're going to do instead, we're going to do the Rebel 5G as the giveaway for that 500 sub count. So stay tuned guys, We are go I am going to pick out somebody. We're going to do, like I said, the people that comment, the 10 people that comment have commented the most throughout the history of the, uh, the life of the channel since the last giveaway, plus liking videos and stuff, they will be, I'll pick 10 persons from there and then we will put the names in a hat and then I will pick the person from there. We're not gonna do comic picker anymore just because honestly, I don't want somebody to just subscribe to the channel to get a free phone and then they unsubscribe. We're gonna do it to loyal fans only. And then um, another thing, if you've been lurking, checking out the live streams, checking out the videos. Why don't you just subscribe already, man? You're already lurking, wasting that time. You might as well hit that notification bell on the bottom. You know, so you're notified every time I upload a video or go live. Check out the description to check out all the links to the socials. You know, you can share this to all your favorite socials also. It'd be greatly appreciated. And donation links are down below too. Uh, we're getting close to reaching a thousand subs, guys. I'm, uh, I'm at 698 right now. So that means I am 302 away. And we will have a big celebration when we do that too. And we will have a... I will do a long, long live stream for you guys too that day. Of course, we will do a giveaway, but we're going to do a long live stream. And I know SMT will be down. I know Techno to be down. We'll get the whole crew together. We'll make something happen for you guys because it's all about you guys. It ain't about me. It ain't about anybody. It's about you guys. You guys make all this happen. And I thank you a lot for everything. And I thank you for your guys' support. And I thank you guys for watching the videos and hitting those thumb like up. And it's thumb, thumbs like down, you know, whatever it is. I appreciate all of you guys. And stay tuned. We are going to do big things with the channel. And I get, like I promised you guys, I'm going to do my best with it. And I'm going to keep it 100. And that's how we're going to do it, guys. All right. Have a great time. Have a good night. Take care. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.
here at the end of this video guys I did not expect this to happen but this screen is done look at that screen there's screen burning right here right here I ended up taking the pictures for you guys for the end of the video and on top of it I ended up uh, uh, doing some speed test and some modem test and some uh, web browsing tests you know to do long longevity of the phone and the phone got so hot because of the 5G modem the 5G connection going in and out as it's doing right now that it ended up getting the mo the back area so hot that it did a screen burn in now it turned the blacks into gray and you can you can see in the background right here where you can see the last image right there right there yeah I don't know what to say about this phone guys uh, if you do get it I would say turn off the 5G feature because it does get the phone really hot T-Mobile's 5G really does suck